Hi, and welcome back to the Lowe's shop class where I'm building an entertainment center. Now, last time in video one, I cut all of the plywood pieces for our project. So this time I'll be assembling most of those together and creating the doors. Speaking of which, let's take a look at our plans. There are three matching door panels and they slide on these aluminum runners. And you'll notice there are two runners that are offset so that one door can slide in front of or behind the other. So we need to cut some grooves in our top and bottom panels to accommodate these runners. What I'll do is I'll set my table saw so the depth of cut is 3 eighths of an inch. Then I'll set my fence so it's 3 eighths of an inch off the blade and run the top and bottom panels through. That'll give me one groove. Then for the second groove, I'll reset my fence to 1 inch and 3 eighths and then run the panels through again. That'll give me two parallel cuts. Now let's set the top and bottom aside for a moment and go back to our plans. The center of our entertainment console is made of this double barred H that's composed of the two dividers and two center shelves. I'll use a five inch spacer to align all our pieces and then apply glue and attach them together using pocket hole screws. Now I'm gonna add the bottom to this assembly. Measure it out and mark the position on the bottom. Then apply glue to the dividers, align the pieces, drill pilot holes and attach it with screws. I can repeat this exact same process on the top and then attach our ends using glue and screws as well. And there we go. That's our main assembly. But now we need some shelves for these side sections here. And I'll start by measuring that distance and cutting those shelves on our table saw. Before I attach the shelves, I'm going to drill pocket holes in the bottom and iron on veneer to the front edge. Once that's done, I can sand it down with 220 grit sandpaper and attach them using pocket hole screws. Well, we've got a couple of pieces left for this portion of the assembly. We've got the doors and the back panel. So I'll start with the panels by cutting them on the table saw and sanding them. Then we'll set them aside and attach them later after the entire project's been stained. Finally, the doors. Cut the three matching door panels on the table saw. And then we're going to add decorative grooves to really spruce up the front of our entertainment center. One of the doors will have a centered vertical groove and two of them will have centered horizontal grooves. And now we have to drill the holes for our door poles. I'm going to use these little cup poles. So I'll use a three quarter inch drill bit and drill three eighths of an inch into the face of the door. Just be careful not to drill all the way through. And there we go. Perfect holes for our door poles. Well, we got a lot of assembly done and our doors are cut and ready to go. So next time in video three, we'll attach the doors, create the base and add the top. I'll see you then.